Hello guys, Jagveer Singh back with another video but this time it's a brand new software called Mastercam 2020 and this software is kind of different from other two CAD softwares in which I generally use to design parts. This is a CAM software which stands for Computer Aided Manufacturing which is different from CAD which stands for Computer Aided Design as we can actually see how the part or any component that we design can be machined in this particular software and it's going to show us and allow us to apply all the features like operations after which we can verify whether the tools and whatever the components that we are looking to design are safe in real-time environment or not it gives us a huge advantage in order to avoid time lags and also it helps us to enhance the ability to increase the productivity of any process by actually verifying how the tool path are going to affect the timing of each operation. That's going to be a very advanced step but in the beginning we are going to talk about just an introduction of what actually Mastercam is and hence this is, our, this is my first video for this particular software then it's just going to be introduction to Mastercam 2020. So right here on screen you can see that this is the main window of Mastercam. When you right click anywhere on the screen you have options to choose zoom window, zoom zoom uh, or zoom out by 80% or dynamic r rotation and all other features just like other CAD softwares too but this is a CAM software don't forget that so let's say I choose isometric view so now so I'm not pretty sure by uh, in some of the default settings you might have this access system available but if you don't you can always press F9 and it will help you to toggle between on and off of this access system if you are facing some trouble using F9 you can always go to view and you can click on show access and it does the same purpose as well so in this video I will tell you just uh, some of the features that might help you to understand how actually Mastercam works so let's say that you want to design something this software can help you with that too if you just want to design just like other softwares which are particularly focused on designing like SolidWorks you can do that too you can also merge any SolidWorks or Katia or any other software part if you want to merge with Mastercam you, you can do that with a feature under file which is merged right here you can do that too that's the best part because what I see is that some of the softwares are interlinked or they need some other softwares to be dependent on in order to serve some purpose but Mastercam help you to design the part within it as well as it also help you to manufacture so it's kind of combination of both the softwares if needed it also come up, come up with a combine combined package of SolidWorks and Mastercam if you try to buy it online it is available on uh, on the internet so this is just my demo version that I'm trying to use so you can download it for free I'm pretty sure you will find some links on the internet to download so right here let me talk about what we have options available right here you can always go to configurations just to make sure that what are the units that you're working with I'm working with metrics right now you can always move to inches if you want you can always choose whatever the colors that you're looking for I try to keep most of the parameters that are by default or I've just changed the thickness of the line that's what I remember I guess that's 
the main thing yeah so by default you're not going to see your thickness of your line to be too dark it can be too thin too slim you can always go to configuration and play around the settings in order to make any kind of change so now i just showed you that this is the line is under wireframe and all other designing features that you might use are going to be under wireframe you can come here you can make all kind of shapes and sizes whichever you want so you can enter the radius and you can click OK and so all the changes are going to be applicable. The only thing with Mastercam is once you clicked OK with that particular feature, you might not be able to change the feature dimension back again. You would need to delete that feature in order to give that particular feature some other dimensions. So be very particular while using Mastercam that you have right dimensions in order to avoid wastage of your time. So, as we, we will go in other videos, I will explain you very precisely how Mastercam is a really important software. But for now, I would just I just wanted you guys to play around, whoever is going to get started with Mastercam, and try to figure out some some features. If you come up with any new feature that you would like to learn, just hit me in the comment section and I do read the comments. So please don't forget to leave a comment if you have any doubt and I would be more than welcome you to share those opinions of yours and with other people through my videos as well. So this is it for this particular video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video. And in next Mastercam videos, you would be able to see all the different kind of practices that you can do with Mastercam. And to be very honest, it is a pretty exciting software from my personal experience. And I'm pretty sure if you like other CAD softwares, you will definitely love this CAM software as well. Okay, take care and stay safe.